St. John Fisher College. You just join us at the top of the hour here. About 4.59 here at 5 o'clock. We're going to get into sports. We're going to get into our one side. Jay Rod, what's up, man? I am doing good. I'm ready for looking forward to another exciting basketball game. Hope it's closer than the last one. So what are you expecting in this men's match? Uh, less turnovers. I mean, as, it, from what I, I see like mess, from, the, from the GCC games last week, it seemed like the men turned over the ball over less than the women. So, I don't know which team's better, but we'll, we'll find out. One thing that I expect is that slam dunks. Oh yeah, men give us more slam dunks and more exciting high-flying action. Just like what we saw last week. Yep. Right now, Edge will see we'll, we'll take on St. John Community uh, St. John Fisher. St. John Fisher is the home of um, the Buffalo Bills training camp. I've yep, been I went there during the summer. First time in that training camp, a lot of fun. Yeah, I went there about two years ago. It's a lot of, it's a lot of fun. Yeah, I went there. Yeah, first time going to the training camp. I got myself a tie rod Taylor t shirt. So, what do you think? Is Tyrod Taylor a franchise quarterback or no? Yeah. He's good. They want to win the franchise. But he can Oh, yeah. Most notable alumni of um, WGCC of St. John Fisher is um, Russ Brand, who is the co who is the president of the Buffalo Bills, Buffalo Sabres, and Rochester Americans. A man I've been very critical of. But um, here is um, a man I think needs to be fired. But anyhow, we'll be talking. Coming up next is the basketball game between Angelina C and St. John Fisher. And this is um, GCC Basketball on 9.7, the music of that.